Hello there. So, you wanna make your old Logitech Quick Confusion work on Windows 10, will you? Well, as you find out, it's not so easy that you thought, so... But don't worry, I was struggling with this uh, whole day and uh, I figured out how you could use it. So, uh, first let's some background. Uh, this is how the Logitech Quick Confusion looks like. So you know, this is right tutorial for you. <laughs> Next, I'm sure you tried to download the driver from the Logitech site. The new Logitech site is terrible. I don't know what got into them. It's very hard to find any drivers at all. But uh, finally, I found some Quick Confusion driver. I use, use downloads. Well, show all downloads use operating system so only only operating system you can select this windows 7 however this camera work fine on xp and vista and uh, even 8.1 so all the logitech site is giving you is 64 bit driver and 32 bit driver for for uh, old os's and of course you tried it and it didn't work you tried to install it maybe you tried to extract driver from it well nothing works i know i have done it so i was almost giving up but then i found this um, microsoft update catalog site uh, where you can search for logitech quick and fusion so it gives you drivers that uh, usually automatically get download from Microsoft. Uh, most of these drivers are totally the same that Logitech site gives you the newest ones that should work on Windows 8.1. Well, it doesn't work. Mm, I tried them all. Uh, I was almost uh, trying to give up, but then I... I I thought maybe I should try the oldest driver there is, released in 2007. And this driver is the one that works with Windows 10 with no problem. So you just click download. What? What happened? Click download. <laughs> what the fuck? All right. I don't know why it's giving me that. Ah, okay. Now it worked. I don't know what the hell. You click on this link. Uh, you save this cabinet file to your PC. Mm, I have already downloaded it. Well, uh, you open it. Mm, and uh, you have to extract all the files. Let's uh, make a new folder. Let's rename it, I don't know, one, two. Let's select all files and copy to this folder and then we open up the device manager this is Estonian language windows but I try to keep keep you <laughs> keep translating English for you so when you usually you have one unknown device here uh, which you wanna I have already installed the driver here but when you have unknown device here, or maybe you had tried some other driver that didn't work, you just have to double click, uh, or easier just to right click and update driver. Then you browse your PC, you browse the place you saved it, this time in desktop folder 12, okay. Then you click uh, 
I don't know in what's English you know uses select and this one uh, says that it's supported driver it's uh, working so then you click next next finish and you have driver installed so now you can use whatever software you want uh, with it it works I don't know why Logitech is making your life so hard they have working driver on Windows 10 it's an old driver I know but um, now you can use it as well and if if you don't want to make this hassle and go to Microsoft site to download driver I put direct link so you can drive the download the driver directly for me but uh, if you if you want you can go just to the site I showed you let's hope they won't take it down soon and that's it have fun with your Logitech quick and fusion camera again like good old times so have a nice day and to the next time bye